everybody. We're the Normies. We're here to watch the Blue Beetle Blue official Beetle. trailer. It's a DC takeover on the Normies. The Normies <sighs> are switching over to being DC yeah, shills now mean. instead of Marvel shills. I'm Surge. I'm Pat. Uh, I'm Spidey. I am Mickey. I'm Rana DC. I screwed back just because he said we're DC shills. I'm still Marvel baby. Marvel Yo, DC is amazing. <laughs> uh, I don't know about no sports uh, master, bro. I don't know yeah. enough about DC to pose yet. I, I love, do. Uh, DC is amazing on its own. Spidey, you don't no, even I watch do. Young I Justice. I love Marvel, but yeah, Young Justice, great. Like Blue Beetles, cold. Green I, Lantern's gonna be ridiculously I good. Hey man, y'all don't know about Sportsmaster though. I tell Sports, you, Sportsmaster is gonna come out of nowhere. He's, he's undeniably a terrifying Sports villain, bro. He, he is. Like, he's I, a scary it sounds dude. like a funny name. The more you think about it, the more you think about it, <laughs> is he lethal? Does he fix games or some shit? He's, he's lethal. A master of he's just all a master sports. of anything he's you would a consider a sport. All sports, all of pole vaulting, archery, sure, long jump, high jump, sprint, football, yeah, long distance running, like Sportsmaster and gun. Hey, okay, so I don't. I don't, know, I don't know shit about Blue Beetle, but I remember this cartoon show back in the day where this guy was like in a blue suit and he had. The, I think it was called Blue Beetle, but it yeah. was like a cartoon. He had a big chin. Is that Blue Beetle? Is that Blue Beetle? Is that the um, <laughs> no, that was, was the Beetleborgs. tick. The tick. Yeah. Yeah, that was the okay, tick. That yeah, was also a really mind, good one. Blue mind. Beetle. It's this kid, uh, Jaime Reyes. He gets this like alien tech scarab attached to his back. The scarab has its own. It's like its own entity, so it talks to him. Kind of uh, okay. like Moon Knight. Yeah, as I was say, very Moon Knight as far as that aspect. Sometimes the Scarab will actually take over, Whoa. and Jaime's got to figure out how to find that balance between like him and Ooh. the Scarab. Okay, yeah, um, so I'm getting like is a good base. Vibes. Yeah. What yeah, did Peter Parker though. say when he came home? I picked pepper peppers. I don't know. <laughs> he said, "Hi, May." <laughs> no. Why are you <laughs> like this? <laughs> right. So this he got bitten by a radioactive no. beetle. I don't think this is. It, the James, I don't think this is James Gunn. That's too soon. He took over very recently. But um, <laughs> Who knows? regardless, we're excited. Let's see what this is. This is a true Normie Maybe reaction. Maybe he's been taken over, and they're just telling us about it. Ah. Most of us, most of us don't know sh about this. I don't know yeah. anything don't know. about Blue Beetle. All I know is I'm George excited. Lopez. Is but we're slowly getting I know crazy. What he just said. I'm wondering because also <laughs> Jaime Reyes is not the first Blue Beetle. Like there was another Blue Beetle before him. So I'm wondering if we're gonna see. Um, hot take. I think we're all sick of Marvel and we're slowly gonna become Let's go DC. To DC. Now. <laughs> yeah, I've been on DC for years. I'm down. like hero shows, man. I'm not hero racist. Hero yes. racist. Here, <laughs> oh, we'll figure it out. Are we ready? Yeah. <laughs> hero racist. Hey. hey. Oh, okay. I just wanna. Ah. I just wanna. Ah. Oh, that actress. Mm -hmm. Ooh, fun colors. Yeah. Sorry, Rich. Ooh. You always land on your feet, bro. You're Jaime. 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 Hey, we got much. Oh, shit. Okay. This track is dope. You went in to get a shot. And all you brought back was a hamburger. Okay, I don't think it's a burger. Yeah, there's a little bit. Nice little bit going on. How did you get it to do that? I think he likes me. Oh, oh wow. Watch that. <laughs> I love that the whole family's here watching this. <laughs> oh, oh, whoa. Well. There it goes. <laughs> I would cry. Yeah, the transformation is never. That looks so good. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> Acquired dog. Oh my god. Make you fly that high? Wow. <gasps> Ew. I would be. Systems ready. Oh. Damn, and that's, that's actually a cool outfit. I just want to. It's called the Scarab. It's some kind of world-destroying weapon. Another Scarab. Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> He's like, oh, fuck yeah. Bruh! That's dangerous. I, I think I kind of bust in half. Speed 3. Scarab chose you, but it belongs to me. Oh! Let's go! Who's that? Susan, Susan Sarandon. Oh! Was that? I couldn't. Fuck, I didn't get that. Look. The universe is sent you a gift. Figure out what you're gonna do with it. 
Whatever you can imagine, I can create. Let's oh, go. Yeah. what? Oh. Yeah, that's awesome. Look at that sword. Hey! That's like bleach sword, bro. Nice choice. <laughs> okay, that's the same. Bro, yeah, it does look like a so Zan Pacto. Yo. Okay. He got his own Zan Pacto. Okay. Oh, man. It's like Batman stuff. Batman's a fascist. <laughs> 100% I am not waiting to react to this. I'm going to see this on IMAX. I don't even know what this is. I'm going to IMAX. I'm sorry. It looks, it looks fun. Make this movie really he, good. Yes, he is. I, I'm a George Love stance a lot. Read oh. where it all began. Yo, that's 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 yeah. good that they're promoting the comics with their trailers. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. great. That's, that's They've great. been doing that with Marvel, too. Have they? Yeah. Hmm. Dude, um, that was gold. I have real tears coming in my eyes. Oh, it's like that was so amazing. Oh, really? Yeah. Man. Dude, they got the outfit. Yeah, that was solid. Oh, that was um, dope as hell. I can appreciate they're showing us that it's not your typical origin. Like the whole family's there to see it. Yeah. So we're not gonna have the whole rigmarole of like he's hiding this thing. Like it's a feels like it'll be a family movie more than anything because they're all there witnessing it. With yeah. Him. Like, he's got his what is that ugly buddy sister. That's not George Lopez getting type. that DC money, baby. It's not America Forever. No, it's not America hey, Forever. Man, She's you, in something else. Forward back to that face where I said, oh! Because, <laughs> like, it, I, I don't want to say who I thought it was because I'm probably going to be violently. I'm violent, surprised how it's cool this uh, Blue Beetle is because I didn't know he could do all those things. That's He's cool. I still don't know shit about him. That guy? That no, was him. no, 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 no. This guy. Mm. Yeah, I would have been wrong. But who is that? It looks so familiar. Yeah, he's nobody. So, <laughs> like, nobody. So, it's like Serge was saying about the family thing, I like that this time he doesn't have to keep his identity, like, secret technically from his family or mm -hmm. whatever. That Like, they know it with him already. So, that takes off some, like, anxiety from him, most likely. Um, what? No, no, I'm sorry. Go for it. Also, when he did um, the sword in front of him, that reminded me of another character. I don't know who. I don't know if you guys can tell no, me. It was, very, like, it was like a very anime yeah. stance. Yeah, it, was, it, was. it was just, I don't know if it was a reference something or not, but that was also reminding me of something I really like that. A lot of the DC movies have been surprising me lately, but this is number one surprise. This looks like they keep learning and more and more and adapting and applying. I don't know. This is going to be awesome. So we got some, some good talent behind the scenes as well. Uh, Director of photography, aka cinematographer, is the same one that did the cinematography for Midsummer, which mm. is crazy. Which That's is, if you've crazy. seen those two movies, crazy. That's why the colors seem to just pop immediately. That was yeah. the first thing I noticed watching this. Yeah, yeah. And the uh, costume designer from Jojo Rabbit, the Thor films. They really got, they got some good stuff. Who did the music? The music was five. Mm -hmm. yeah. Who did do the music? Oh, that was pretty sweet. Yeah, that was a great trailer. I, I. Another good trailer, just but just because I don't know anything about this, so I'm like, I, I, I like it was a good trailer that kind of shows you what the character's all about, but we don't really know much past that. So, but solid, yeah. yeah I mean, just great. the visual again. It, I feel like it's gonna be a really good movie. Solid. What has been getting Xbox for what? This could be like that sleeper, like kind of like Iron Man, like before that came out, like most people they were like fucking Iron Man, what the fuck, right? And then it turned out to be like the biggest thing. Yeah, this feels like. <laughs> It's not taking itself too seriously, and it kind of knows what it is. And, um, yeah. you know, D DC, I see it now as just, like, these zany characters. And, like, you know, they were technically there first before Marvel. Mm -hmm. So it's good that the balance is kind of shifting, in my opinion. Or at least more people are giving DC a chance now because... Mainstream-wise, uh, not the... Yeah, ma mainstream. Strictly normie speak. <laughs> yeah. It's true. More people are yeah. giving DC yeah, a chance. Look, you still look. It's number one trending still, and this is like the second day now. Yeah, because Marvel has yeah. been on. Got <laughs> man, you still cheering on Marvel? Yeah, I don't think Marvel's that bad. It's factually. You gotta true. give it to they've them. They, they, they've they've been started been the something decline. crazy though. Of they, course, they, they, yeah, of course, of course. But they've been I, on the decline. That's not. Oh, well, here's the know. thing about DC though. The stories have always been good. We can like both. We can like both. You can like both. No, the DC. Okay, Marvel. Okay. The DC stories, honestly, are amazing, especially if you actually watch, like, crossover episodes and go back from the beginning. They're really good. What the problem is with DC is, and I've noticed in a lot of movies and shows and whatever, it's the team that they hire sometimes. They just need better... CW. C it's CW <laughs> yeah, stuff, honestly. CW's kind of been slapping. It's CW. I mean, <laughs> lately, yeah, because they've been getting better. They're learning. That's yeah. what I'm saying. But back in the day, they didn't catch interest because I don't feel like they had the same god level team that Marvel did and went all out with. Like the minute we saw Iron Man one, we're all we were all like, oh my God, fuck, fuck. 
But yeah. give you some DC movies they try to put out in the past, we're all like, hmm, it's good. They try. We see what they're trying to do there, but it's not hitting it. But now they're trying to hit it, and you can see it. AKA the Snyderverse was a little bit of a flop, even though we all really enjoyed the Snyder Cut Justice League edition. Yeah, we can all agree that that DCEU obviously fizzled out, not giving them I, what they wanted revenue-wise. Like, Snyder is apparently still leaving, like, little clues on Twitter and stuff, so... We, yeah, might, there's something new coming. It might, it might not be... So, James Gunn is developing, like, eight new projects for DC. He's Certain things, like the Joker films, are constituted as, like, elsewhere. So, like, they can still be under the DC umbrella, but they don't have to fall under the cinematic canon. It's so, now that there is a Kevin Feige-esque figure behind the DCEU, and it's someone as talented as James Gunn, I do think we're in for some good DC content. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. I hope, I hope, I hope. Bye! Bye. <laughs>